The engine I have here, it's called, uh, I refer to it as the Ultimate Victory. The, my original V8 was a um, 44cc um, V8, but it wasn't water cooled or anything like that. Missing a lot of features. This uh, new version is. Now, it has uh, some other features. Stainless steel exhaust pipe. Uh, manifold. It still uses the uh, one quarter 32 spark bug and uh, has uh, the distributor back here but the distributor in this particular model is driven by a spiral gear rather than a bevel gear like it was in the uh, original Victory engine. Um, it has the Machined uh, distributor cap. I machined it on my uh, CNC milling machine, Bridgeport, and I use uh, test lead wire from uh, Radio Shack for the spark plug wires. Um, <clears throat> rather than machining the name on the uh, valve cover, I uh, stuck it on uh, here uh, off printed material and then lacquered it. Um, I use a uh, OS carburetor. From an OS32 helicopter engine, got a little different designed air cleaner here. Now this has one carburetor, but I you notice that on the carburetor plate here I have uh, room to uh, for two, so eventually plan on putting dual carburetors on it. This has a water system. Got the water pump up here in front. I don't know if you can see it. Maybe I'll move the camera around here a little bit. Water pump here, driven by. Uh, fan belt here. I have three O-rings as fan belt. Got a fan. The radiator of course. The radiator is made up of aluminum and it's uh, glued together with uh, GMB weld. Have the uh, drain here. Now normally I have a uh, uh, collection uh, bottle down here like they have in a modern radiator system. Um, there are water cooling passages around the cylinders and also through the head. So the water is pumped out of the water pump and pumped through the block, comes out of the rear end of the block up into the head and uh, passes through the head and then through the manifold to the outlet right here where it goes back into the radiator. Um, I have a splash oil system. The oil is contained in the crankcase and uh, this engine runs on straight fuel. There's no oil in the fuel. have a uh, dipstick here for, for measuring the uh, oil and unfortunately it does burn a little bit. That's the way it is I guess. Um, <clears throat> did I mention OS carburetor? I'm sure I did. Um, now on the original Victory the uh, Hall effect ignition sensing system was in the distributor and it caused me a, a number of running issues because of the heat generated uh, passed, passed, passed up through the aluminum and would cook some of the electronics. So in this particular case I put the ignition, you can see the wire right here, the timing Hall effect magnets and such out here on the front of the engine where it runs quite a little bit cooler. It's got air blowing over it from the fan and uh, it's it's been a lot uh, more trouble free. Although I did have to change the cam uh, for the ignition to four lobes instead of eight like you would have back here. This is a steel crankshaft and a steel camshaft. Brass timing gears, you can't see them because they're in behind the cover here and uh, got a big brass flywheel here on the back um, brass gas tank and uh, I don't know if you can see that very well here Put the camera around here a little bit uh, spun end bells in the gas tank and the uh, radiator holds a few ounces of water you fill it up here See, it's got 
cover right there. I'll put that on later. And the uh, air cleaner. Here's the aluminum. Um, it's on. So that's uh, pretty much what I have. Uh, aluminum uh, block, aluminum manifold. Most everything's aluminum. All parts were made by me except for spark plugs, which are NGK ME8 spark plugs. Uh, nuts and bolts, screws, of course, um, and the carburetor. Uh, can't think of much else. It has uh, bronze uh, shell bearings in the rods, much different than the original Victory, which was just uh, aluminum bearings. That's pretty much what it is. We'll start it up. So, we'll see if we can get it started here. First thing we'll do is hook a little power up for the ignition. And we'll use the electric starter. Quarter inch drive. Ultimate victory. Thank you for listening.